hundred more euros in the week. Around their midlife, neutral, slightly bearish, stunning year, but really not relevant unless we break the bottom of the range, which is eleven twenty. And more relevant of all is that prices approaching to the vertex of uh, of this kind of triangle we have in here, and. As closer we get to vertex, the less value will be the figure, you know, with a break of any of this uh, trend lines will become less relevant if we continue because it will break because of lateralization and not because of its directional momentum. So honestly, I'm still believing that and when it comes to the top of the trend line, sorry, 1280 seems to be the key. The trend line is a bit below that level for this day, 1250, 1260 for uh, this week. But honestly, if we don't take 1280, I don't see too much chances of an upward continuation, right? Anyway, and in the shorter term, my levels are 12, right? The figure 12, 12, 10, above that level 1240, okay? And above that, the 1280. I'm not expecting a pair to break above this today, but if it does uh, during the coming days, 1335, which is uh, August high, okay, it's the, my my next bullish target, right? I have yet to be see if a pair is able to hold gains above 113 after any initial spike. If it does, then uh, I would expect an upward extension up to 1416 during the next few days, although. Uh, that is quite unlikely to be honest. I don't see nothing supporting that. I, I don't see much supporting the downside either. But anyway, that's what's going on with this pair. As I said, 1120 is uh, the base of the range. The pair has bottomed there a couple of times. August, September, below that level, the trend line is around 1080, 1090 for this this upcoming uh, sessions, I would say that below that level, we can go down to 1040, 1030, right? And uh, in here, in this 110, 11040 region, the pair will be at risk of a downward extension, but we need to close the week, I don't know, maybe below 130 to talk about a probable downward extension to what the 800, 850 region in the next uh, days, weeks, and uh, so far, as I said, there's no technical readings in here telling me that we are going to go in a certain direction. And what's going on with the euro dollar, despite we all think or it's well known as being the most rated pair, is that uh, we are getting no clues from central banks. Both central banks are on hold and we probably remain so for a couple of months, right? We, we have US elections in November. So it's unlikely that the Fed will act, if it does, before December, right? And on the other hand, the ECB is on imp in its implementation stage, according to Draghi. No new easing coming, no news, no change in the BS or in the policy. So pretty much is that the market has no close. How do I trade this pair with both central banks uh, on hold? That's, that's what's the market thinking, okay? Uh, so, 